How is it going, boys and girls? Darb guy here, and welcome back to another ranked Joust video. And today we are hard slamming an Athena game, testing out the new Warlock staff buffs. I know if you look to your left side of your screen, it doesn't look like a Warlock staff there, okay? But I'm not going Warlock staff first item. I will just die off cooldown. I will be permanently dead if I do that. So I'm going to start off my build with a Sovereignty, a Sov, a Sovereignty, 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 Sovereign. Yellow, yellow boobies that gives HP 5 and mitigates physical damage. I should have done that immediately. To you and your teammates. I'm going to start with that, and then I'm going to work my way into a Warlock Staff and go from there. But on Warlock Staff was buffed and it was given an extra 100 HP, which makes it the highest HP item in the game. The shock seems to be distracting my teammates pretty well, which is unfortunate. But we're just going to go Sov into Warlocks, and we should get some value off of that. I don't have anything up, maybe we can get a double kill here. There's one, Neath jumps us down. I don't have anything up. He actually killed me there. Why did he... How did he hit an auto for 110 damage, by the way? A level 4 shock hitting a level 4 guardian for 110 with one auto through a Sov and a warrior's axe. That does not make even the remote... Mo the, even the smallest amount of sense. 110 for one auto at this stage is unreal. Unfortunate. Stop their back though. Nonetheless though, if you find yourself enjoying this video, make sure to let me know by subscribing. I really do want to hit 1k by the end of the year, and um, I post every single day, so you might find- you will find something you like. Why is she walking that way? She killed herself to avoid the taunt. What an awful play. <laughs> Her options were taunt, beads, and run away because she's pushed up solo. Um, Siren's gonna go from behind them. We get a double kill here, or at least a kill on shock. Okay, where is my Cernanos? Why is my Cernanos? Ranked or set. I need to remember that. Tons of really bad players are gonna be in every queue now. That was a the worst of the worst possible play that Cern could have made. Dropping a double kill to suicide for a buff is crazy. Oh, he's dead. There's no point in ulting to him. I'm shocked that Cern managed to mess that up that badly. What a horrendous play. I feel like the worst of the worst silver player would know not to do that, but of course my Cernos is. Somehow beneath a silver player in these plat diamond queues. It is what it is. I'm shocked at both of my deaths this game. My first death, I'm just shocked that sh shocked that shock had the damage to kill me there. Second death, I put my faith in my teammate, and it always comes back to bite me. Always. Anytime I ever trust my teammates, I die because of it nine out of ten times. So I need to really just stop doing that. Oh, he is for sure blaming his team right now. Luckily, their Nox is a very bad player, so it's still kind of working out. I want to get her dash down. She's going to walk up, and I'm going to taunt her. She has no dash, so she shouldn't, and there she is. There's over half her HP. Almost a kill. I do like this Agni, though. This Agni's been following up very well with me. Wait to jump down, if she subs up again, she's dead. She just jumps the second I get near her, which is not the play, because then she just dies to my taunt. I think Star Suicide traded again for the kill. Can't do anything about that. They're both off my Agni, and... Hopefully I can get out. 
Oh my Agni's still here. He needed to really just leave. Luckily their Nox is dead again. I can eat that for you. My game disconnected. I hate it though. Good. Love my servers. This game has been awful so far. This has been a very unenjoyable five minutes of Smite. But that's fine. We'll go into the Warlock staff. This gives like how much HP does this give? Probably like nine hundred and fifty thousand, if I had to guess. At least three. Between that, between those two numbers for sure. Is it gonna be good on Guardians? Eh. No. <laughs> Is it going to be good on some mages that need the HP? Yes. <laughs> but I want to play Athena, so I'm kind of just building it on her. So I'll give HP. Yeah, I know it gives HP 5, but does it give HP? There we go, we had the jump down just by looking at her again. My Cern is really in there. <laughs> the wall stops her from being taunted. I'm gonna eat that for her. Take all that. Ugh! Can't shoot that one. I wanna clear this wave. Um, I'm backing in my Warlock staff. I do wanna start getting this sack soon, because it's 800 damage a sack, I think. I think. Don't quote me on that. Luckily, you can you stack it by taking damage and dealing damage, just not only dealing damage, which is why it's not bad to build on Athena. Well, maybe not bad is a overstatement, but it's not like hard that. Mm, it's kind of hard to stack. It's not impossible to stack on a Guardian because you can just take a lot of damage, which a lot of the time you do. Yeah, I'm taking a drink real quick. Where's your Aegis? Cernos' mechanics aren't even bad though. His decision making is atrocious, but his mechanics are good. Like he's landing a lot of his autos, he's getting a lot of kills, he's landing his abilities. He's dying for it a lot, but... I'd rather have a teammate dying for kills than being 0-19 like my usual teammates, so... I will, I will literally 1v1 you. I will beat the shit out of you. <laughs> I just soloed their Neath, bro. That's insane. <laughs> Is that a Warlock staff thing, or is that just a Neath thing? I'd say it's just a Neath thing. I'm dead. Holy shit, that did se 700 damage. I took 700 damage to that combo. I need some Magical D. <laughs> she died for it though. Yeah, their Nox is definitely the weakest link in the lobby. I mean, that combo did... that hurt. I won't lie. The combo did hurt. <laughs> Um, if he gets into an engagement, I could teleport up to him, but if I don't need to, I won't. I'm just gonna do it. I know my Serenos is a very aggressive player. This is dead. Okay. I kind of took that kill accidentally, but... Um... I didn't think <laughs> we were gonna kill that fast. Nox missed everything. I missed my taunt. My cooldowns are kind of bad, so I don't know if I can kill here, but you can definitely get everything she owns down. My Agni flanks. Not enough. We don't have enough cooldown. And by enough cooldown, I mean we don't have literally any cooldown. We have 0%.
I don't want to lose this whole wave. I will solo you again. My damage is still not bad. Obviously, I do like a, a fourth of their HP base kit with Athena in this meta, which is very good. But with Warlock stuff, I'm kind of doing like a third of their HP. It's kind of not horrible. I mean, I died once off of not having, you know, a defensive item there in that slot, but it happens. Maybe I should have went Archer at first. I don't know what she's doing here. And that was quite possibly the worst possible play you could have made. She tried to be toxic, ended up losing her beads off of her being a bad player because she wasted her silence, missed everything, <laughs> and then beads. Their Nox is definitely the worst player in the lobby. I don't think there's any concern for that. And she's dead again. Yeah, their Nox is absolutely worthless. Thank God he is not on my team. You on this guy instead. I guess I don't know if I can kill this. How did that Agni ability not kill? I got the kill. Don't worry, guys. <laughs> Schmack. And they surrender. So spam laugh and then surrender at ten. Welcome to the ranked reset, where gold players will be in every lobby. But nonetheless, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have an amazing rest of your nights. Peace. So I want it so they f**k you and leave Hope that every day you shit scratches your face and you bleed No one even comes out cause you just left to with ease There is someone who comes